always been growing canola for a long time. We've moved right out of sheep about eight or nine years ago and went to 100% cropping rotation basically. And now I've had to slowly peg back the, the, uh, the cash crop side of things and actually try and control a few of our weeds. That pressure that the plants put on weeds is by far your cheapest and best weed control. Yeah, so the bigger and stronger you can get a plant quicker, that'll smother out um, smother out a lot of weeds. Typically we're growing a lot of triazines in here, um, basically for the, the, the residual in the back end of the season and we've typically used a lot of clethodum in the, in the system and it, it's starting to hit a bit of a wall and we've since gone elsewhere in, in different systems within canola, basically to control those same grasses. And we've had some trials in like, like these ones here. 44 y 26 with 404 either side of it. Through the season, it was probably through its like middle of its vegetative stage, it was probably actually a lot more aggressive, had a, a lot bigger leaf on it, and it, it did close in the canopy in a lot quicker. And it was roughly planted at the same like seeds per kilo per hectare. Um, so that was probably the only difference through the middle of the year. It did have a, um, a little bit different uh, like flowering pattern at the end of the year, but um, it probably flowered for the same amount of days at the end of the year and it's just, a, it's a taller variety than the 404. Um, but apart from that, the header will tell the real story.